Today is the day the Lord has made, and we rejoice and are glad. For today we celebrate the goodness of God's gift of love. The love that created the universe, the love that created us, the love that brought Kristen and Patrick together, and the love that is Jesus. When I think back over the past 19 years and how Kristen has grown and evolved, there are a handful of things about her that have always remained constant and are still true to this day. Kristen has always been strikingly beautiful. She is my Italian best friend with the beautiful long brunette hair. And I love that Pat's hair matches hers, just shorter, straighter, and from Irish jeans. Kristen is not only funny, she's particularly witty and smart. She's also an extremely hard worker. She's had a job every season of every year I've known her, including side jobs as an adult. And in general, she just puts the discipline and hard work into whatever she's looking to achieve. And I really admire that about her. And then last but not least, her kind heart. In the song I sing, you're the melody. Now Pat. Kristen has been waiting for you for a very long time. Thank you for making her so incredibly happy. I couldn't ask for a more stand-up guy for Kristen to share her life with. You could call it destiny, or as the Italians say it, buena fortuna, or luck of the Irish. It is clear that this relationship was meant to be. So people say that relationships are 50-50. I have to believe that relationships are 100% and 100%. Neither Pat nor Kristen do anything halfway. Their families, their friends, their professions, their hobbies, and their relationships, each facet of their lives afford the full attention and dedication. I know that they will continue to grow as individuals and as a couple, and both will put 100% towards one another. Love is patient. Love is kind. Mr. Leeson, that time. Don't bother with it. It is not jealous. It is not pompous. It is not inflated. It is not rude. Ready? It bears all things, believes all things, hopes all things, endures all things. Love never fails. I, Patrick, take you, Kristen, to be my wife. I promise to always be faithful to you in good times and in bad, in sickness and in health, to honor and to love you all the days of my life. I, Kristen, take you, Patrick, to be my husband. I promise to be faithful to you in good times and in bad, in sickness and in health, to love and to honor you all the days of my life. We've all learned to kiss and to borrow A bondsman full of a bondsman bear Kristen received this ring as a sign of my love and fidelity in the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Patrick received this ring as a sign of my love and fidelity. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. It has been said that love requires time. It requires work. It requires sacrifice. But it is always punctuated with reward. So please raise your glass and help me wish Kristen and Pat a lifetime filled with the reward of love.
May you be blessed in your children, have comfort in your friends, and enjoy true peace with everyone. May you be witnesses in the world to God's love, so that the afflicted and the needy who have known your kindness may one day receive you thankfully into the eternal dwelling of God. And may Almighty God bless you all, the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen.